Good afternoon. It has been a battle for months. Who is in control of more than $1.75 billion of federal pandemic relief money coming to New Mexico? The governor or legislature? Well, now that that money is available, the fight is heating up. News 13's Jamie Seymour joins us with what's next. Kim, earlier this spring, Governor Michelle Lujan Grisham vetoed the legislature's bill that would allocate the spending of $1 billion of that relief money, saying they couldn't decide until the money is in our state. Well, now it's in the state's hands, so we wanted to know what's next. Now, not only is the money available to us, but we know what the rules are. So you can't spend uh, and meet the requirements if you don't know what those requirements are. The governor says their top priority is getting this money into the unemployment insurance fund, as well as lost revenue for state agencies. But some state lawmakers on both sides of the aisle say that's not the governor's money to spend, and according to state law, the legislature has the right to allocate that federal money that comes into the general fund, something they did already this session before their bill was vetoed. While some are preparing to work alongside the governor to allocate this money, others are preparing for a potential legal battle. I think I had a conversation with the executive and, and we're in agreement that we're going to work together to, to place these funds and see where they go. If we won't come in to do a veto override, then you know we're going to have to take her court to keep that money from being spent illegally. The governor's office tells us they're also looking at putting money into behavioral health broadband and recovering areas hard hit like the tourism industry. According to the U.S. Treasury, New Mexico is receiving $1.25 billion based on the number of unemployed we have, along with an additional $500 million that each state is getting. Kim? Okay, thanks, Jamie. Now, the governor's office says it is still reviewing the guidelines from the Treasury Department. They do not have a set date on when these funds will be distributed.